Hi everyone, welcome to Mila and Me Weeks. Two weeks because I didn't do one last week. No excuse, no reason, I just didn't do it. So we are doing week 17 and week 18. Crazy! Well that must mean if I'm doing week 17 and week 18, that must mean Mila is 19 weeks old. Is she 19? I don't know, I can't be bothered going back and working it out, but maybe she is only 18 weeks. Yeah, maybe she's 18 weeks yesterday. Oh my god. With Roman, I like knew exactly how old he was. He's like 18 and a half weeks. Whereas in three hours and six seconds, you know, like. <laughs> Whereas Mila, I'm like, oh, I can't remember. <laughs> I have to have these vlogs to remind me how old she is. But I think, I think she must be 18. She's, she must be 18 weeks old. I don't know. Anyway, so um, we had something exciting happen in the past week. Well, for me, anyway. Well, my husband's pretty proud of me too, but we made 6K subscribers! Woo woo! Thanks guys so much for subscribing. I am so pleased that so many of you have followed along this journey, loved our journeys, and um, are hanging around to watch our kids grow. Oh my gosh, that kid is going to break something in the back there. Roman, please be careful. <laughs> oh my gosh. So that's right, we made 6,000 subscribers, actually just a little bit more than that now. Um, we hit 6,000 on Friday night, I think. Today's Monday. What have we got? We're now at, we're now at 6,000 and you can't even see. 6,000 and 24 subscribers. That's you guys! So because we hit 6,000 subscribers, I said that we were going to do, a, why am I saying we? I said that I was going to do a giveaway. So just a quick recap of the items I've got to give away. We've got this little nappy holder pouch thing. We've got some mama bars by Oka Baby. And we've got some really, really cute dribble bibs. Look how little that neck is. It's for like newborns. Um, and also, I haven't got it yet, but I was also going to get um, something from... Um, Kai Carrier, which is like the pouches, reusable pouches that you can squeeze. Um, yeah, so I've got all that to give away and I'll do that in a separate video though with all the details, so just keep an eye out for that. I think this is going to be a fairly short vlog because it actually, probably the reason why I didn't do week 17 was because there's just not a lot going on to be honest. Um, we're just plodding along, eh Mila? Yes we are. Mila is just so freaking cute. She doesn't have a headband on today guys. Shock horror. Oh my goodness. So the stats on Mila, she now weighs 5.72 kilos which is 12 point something pound. Um, we did try her on solids um, about a week or so ago. Um, yeah, I don't think, I don't know if she's quite ready. She either just didn't like it. I tried it for a couple of days because, you know, even though they might pull faces at you one day, you just got to kind of persevere and try the next day and the next day. But after three days of just trying a little bit, she was just, I just don't think she's ready. So um, I'm going to wait another, you know, maybe three, four weeks or even, just, you know, wait till she's five months old and try then. Um, Roman, you'd put a spoon to his mouth and he'd just open up wide, swallow amazingly. Whereas Mila, she's just, she's pursing a lip, like, don't put that in my mouth. I don't want it. And if I do get any in your mouth, she's just, like, spitting it right back out again. Um, so I'm just going to leave it and we're going to try again in another month or so. And, you know, I'm in no hurry. She's in no hurry. She's happy. So... Yeah, we'll, we'll give it a go in another month. So, Mela's in a pretty good routine now. Um, so, her routine... My kid in the background there is just going to wreak havoc. Um, so, her routine is that she gets up about 7.30. Um, she'll have a feed, a play. She'll go to bed at 9am. And then she'll sleep till like 11.30-12. Then she'll get up again. She'll go back down to bed. At like, same routine, you know, feed, bum change play and then she'll go down at like one in between one and two depending on how cranky she is and then she'll sleep till five um most of the time she'll sleep till five she might get up a little bit earlier just depends on her mood and then um her feed play again um bath into pajamas and then into bed by 7 7 30 and then she'll Wake in the night maybe once. Um, she never used to. She used to sleep right through, but she wakes in the night now, but that's fine. Um, so she wakes in the night about three, it between three and five, and has that feed, and then she'll get up for the day at 7.30. She's gotten a lot more personality now, and it's really, What's she's really that? fun. Like, she What's squeals. That? Well, how about I tell you when I when I tell everyone in the camera what they are? It's looking at all these baby buys down here that I've got to show you. Um, 
like she squeals and she lets you know when she's happy and she's upset and if she wants rum to just get out of her face. Um, a lot of personality, so a lot of fun. She's getting to a really fun age and I just, oh careful, careful, careful. Um, and I just love her to bits, it's, she's just really exciting now. I, I love the newborn stage and then I love the stage when they start interacting with you. As for me, my phone says nothing new, <laughs> nothing new with me. Um, I still haven't got my hair done, I'm still red, I keep intending on going to the hairdresser and getting it done but it's just, A, it's so expensive, B, it's just finding time to get out the house and actually get it done and <laughs> did you hear it? Do you want to, oh no I've got to do these baby buys and then you can hop up and say hello. Are you excited? Are you all excited? <laughs> She's so cute. All right, so yeah, nothing new with me really. No, nothing with my hair. Nothing to do with weight loss. I I feel pretty boring actually. Nothing, nothing with me at all. All I've been doing recently is sorting out my vlogs for the past three months. I use Google Calendar, and I put in every Monday is obviously Mila and me. Um, I'm now doing vlogs on Wednesdays, and they are top five vlogs. So I'll be doing like top five tips for new parents, top five toddler breakfast, top five um, newborn sleep tips, yeah, all that kind of stuff. So it'll be top five. I've already done top five newborn must-haves. Um, so Wednesdays are now going to follow along with the whole top five thing. Um, and then on Fridays it's fun day, which will be, you know, tags and all that and just what's in my nappy bag, which I think is coming up this Friday. Um, just fun stuff like that. And then in between there may, oh my gosh, four vlogs a week, <laughs> crazy. But there may be a vlog in between, which is one that just doesn't fit on the Wednesday or the Friday that is just something that I've got to slot in somewhere. So there may end up being four vlogs a week. Very busy, busy, busy. I'm gonna get into these baby vibes and then we'll say hello to Mila. So first one we've got is a teething, an amber teething necklace. Um, whether they work or not, I don't know. I don't, I don't really think they do, but they look cool anyway. But um, so Mila wears this during the day. Oh, here's a yawn as usual. Mila wears this during the day and then at night I take it off just because um, I don't know. I, I, I just it makes me nervous. Roman wears his constantly now. He's worn his for a good two and a half years, I think. I think he's about six months old when he wore it permanently. Um, yeah, he's just worn his constantly. Roman, put that back, please. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, so I don't really know if they really work or not, but they look cute anyway. Um, what else can I show you? This here um, is a gift from my auntie. My auntie Debbie is a um, lovely lady, and she buys... Um, the kids in our family a uh, gift when they're born. So Roman, he got, what did he get? I think he got a rocking horse actually, I think was his first gift. And so Mila's is this beautiful um, jewelry box and it even has her name engraved in the top. Hey, hop off there please. And inside I've just put her bracelet from Stacey and Brennan which she still doesn't fit. So this is a jewelry box. Jewelry box. Jewelry box. Yeah. And Mila's bracelet is in there. Keeps your jewelry safe. Yeah. And what does that say? Can you see what that says? That says, it says keep it safe. <laughs> it says keep it safe. The writing on there is actually really pretty. I don't know if I can. Hey look, there's my camera. Hello. Yeah, I don't think it's going to work. Um, so as well as that, she bought something else which she said it's a little bit older so she won't be able to wear it for a while but, she, but it's just, it's gorgeous so it's this necklace. It's a locket so we'll be able to put a picture of mummy and daddy in there or something, I don't know. But it's a beautiful necklace so that's going to be put away for safekeeping until she's old enough to be able to look after it. Alrighty, the other item we have is my husband has gone on a bit of a pallet hobby spree he's made so many like herb boxes out of palettes and he spray paints it and so the words herb comes out in the natural palette color um but he made this for mila um i always said that i wanted this quote on her wall and so he made it for me and says look at the stars look how they shine for you that was the, the song lyrics of and mila's infertility journey 
Um, so yeah, he's just banged it together out of pallets and he's gonna make a whole heap more. He made a name one with like cute girly ribbon on it for a friend who just had a baby. Oh my gosh, my child. It's the school holidays, can you tell? Um, my kid's gone crazy because he's not at kindy. So yeah, he's having a lot of fun making those. He's like out in a shed till midnight building all the stuff. So I've got to put that on Mila's wall eventually. Um, last thing I've got to show you before I bring Mila up here, I don't know how I'm going to show you this without it falling over. I'm putting together Mila's shadow box and everything's moved, everything's gone moving now because it's not all glued together. Because I'll be making a bit of a separate video on this, with, like music, I don't know, just something pretty. So um, you guys will get a closer look at that soon but I just thought I'd show you what I've been working on. Let's bring Mila up here to say hello. You're gonna come say hello. You're gonna come say hello. And Mila's not wearing a headband today. I got to Here's Mila. Look. She um I'm so not used to her not wearing a headband. But seriously, the first I four months the four months you can come say hello. I mean she's been alive for four months now and well born for four months now and I think she's not worn a headband like literally I could count on one hand the number of times she hasn't worn a headband. Can you help me get out? Here's your headband. Can you get me out? Get you out? Oh, Roman's sitting in Mila's little bouncy thing down there and wanting me to get him out like I did Mila. Oh, he's, he's feeling a bit left out I think because of the new baby even though we tried desperately hard to include him in things. Can you help me? Mila. Can You're looking very white in today. Maybe we might need to darken this camera. Oh, how about I put Mila down and I'll bring you up in a second. In a minute, okay? Put Mila down there. Yeah, I will. I'll put Mila down there. Let's darken the camera a little bit. There we go. That's better. You say hi to the camera. I love being able to put her in these vlogs every week because then I'm going to be able to look back and like watch her grow pretty much every week. She's pretty in pink today. Oh, Alright, another her. full look. <gasps> look at these little toes. Oh, hello. So Mila, yeah, I can definitely tell she's getting on the heavier side. Oh, you're getting on the heavier side now. She's still in, like, she's only kind of just gone into her zero to three month clothes. I've only just kind of moved up. Okay into her wardrobe all of her newborn clothes some stuff that she still fits newborn because she's so short she's still chubby she's chunky she's got good she's got good meat on her so i'm pleased about that oh golly oh golly here we go here's the children all right you're gonna say hello hello say hi youtube hi Nancho. good boy um so that's pretty much it for today gosh that was a short vlog uh i don't know if i've got anything to show you in maybe i could put a few photos in because some of you don't have Facebook, so you don't see the photos that I put up on Facebook. I might put some photos in. How about that? Then I'll make it a bit longer. Um, but yeah, so keep a watch out for all my new vlogs. I'm excited about having all these vlogs to do. It's almost turning into a bit of a job. But like, a fun job, of course. I enjoy doing it. All right, Mila. Say hello and goodbye. You can look at the camera. <gasps> say hello and goodbye. Mila's wearing a cute little lacy top today. <laughs> And that's Roman's Ra. He's learned about all about tigers at kindy lately. Hey, Miss Mila. All right, guys. So that's pretty much it. That was a very pathetic vlog today. I'm sorry, but there's just there's just nothing been going on. But I thought I'd better get on here and say hello anyway. So hello and goodbye, and thank you so much for watching. And that was the lamp. Oh my goodness, Roman is. Okay, I think it's time to go because Roman's like wreaking havoc with this bedroom right now. It is such a mess just from the 10 minutes I've been sitting here. Oh, Lord help me in the school holidays. Hey, say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.